Skirt was um still is and was iconic. Um and uh maybe iconoclast at that and an inspiration. And one of the South Central Kings. Um the one one of the very few we have that still reps South Central as loyal to South Central and uh and even Nipsey, Nipsey knows who Skirp is. Nipsey Hustle. Rest in peace. literally literally like I'm not gonna lie to you dude like probably close to like 50 close friends and family members like my friends you know and it's just like you know being sober sucks but the level of violence I think that I've experienced ooh uh I mean dude like it's just that I, 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 gotta, I gotta keep it normal somehow, you know? Like, you know, the gang shit, the drug shit, the gun shit. Um, it's all here, man. This is the real deal right here. This is straight poverty, dude. And poverty breeds ignorance, and ignorance breeds violence. And violence, pain, you know? And when you get used to that shit, it's fucking sad, dude, you know? I'm a, you know, child of the 80s. Uh, there were a lot of gangs, and there was a lot of, like, drugs, and there was violence, you know? I wanted to do something bigger, you know? Like, I wanted to get out of my community. Like, I grew up in South Central, and that's where, like, I discovered graffiti, you know? Like, our friends are gang members, our friends are doing a bunch of stuff. But when I started picking up the, the graffiti thing, just, like, started seeing these murals and stuff. So I was like, whoa, and then I started meeting people that did graffiti. So they were just like, well, you got to get a name. We've got to be unique. You know what I mean? So I sat down and I just broke down these letters in the alphabet. And I really like like these letters. And so I said, so I just played around with them and shit. And then finally I came up with my name. Uh, I've been painting for 30 years, you know? Uh, so I'm, I'm allowed, you know, certain things. When you're young, when you're starting in this community, like you have to do your bones, you know, now... People have pressurized cans, people have the internet. It was very hard for us to be, you know, renowned, I guess would be the word, because we don't want to be known. We do this for, we do this for us, you know what I mean? Like, this is like my outlet, dude. It, it's like, uh, 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 it's therapy and shit, you know? We want to like, just basically, like, do our little hobby, do our little outlet, do our little therapy without having to go to jail. Like, you can't criminalize me for my experiences in my community, dude. Like, like I'm showing you guys, like, what I've been through and shit. If anything, dog, like, I'm trying to enlighten people. I want to I wanna take this art form and I want to create a movement in Watts and, and, and beautify the fucking hood, you know, and bring people from all over the world. And you don't have to be scared if you want to come to Watts. You know what? We already did the footwork for us to be here. So you come from London, guess what? You can paint watts. You're actually archiving stuff that people overlook, you know what I mean? Like, when, when you talk about graffiti being documented in Los Angeles, like, for some reason, we're always left out. South Central, mm -hmm. like, watts and shit, you know? Like, it gets left out, you know what I mean? They like the more glamorous uh, aspect of graffiti, but, you know, I think that's where, that's where you guys are coming in right now. You know who the fuck you can inspire a hundred years from now.